extremely new cricketer for Australia. Player number 230, Cameron Green. Hoisted away to the next side. He'll have a piece of that, Cam Green. <laughs> Take that. Got the news I was playing a day or two before. So I had a good couple of days to kind of get over the nerves. I was actually more nervous the game before because Smudge was a bit sick. So I was a bit touch and go to play. So kind of good in a way, I kind of got that out of the way. Then when the second time came around, I had that to fall back on. I called my parents obviously straight after. Yeah, incredibly proud. I think JL had actually spoken to them both before I spoke to them. So they tried to pretend they hadn't known the news yet. I quickly said, okay, come on, I know you already know. Um, and yeah, it was just a nice moment. Woke up on game day, uh, basically like any other day. I think the game was pretty late, so I wasn't too nervous in the morning. Had a few hours to kind of uh, get the nerves out of the way a little bit and kind of switch off. But yeah, yeah on game day, I was pretty nervous. Number two, Cameron Green, good luck. It's obviously incredibly humbling to get my cap from Steve. Obviously, he's Australia's best player um, for the last probably decade or so. Um, and if so, if not more. So yeah, it's incredibly nice. I didn't know it was going to happen, but to get it from him, I'm going to remember that forever. Good start. I'm incredibly nervous before my first ball. And I'm normally never nervous bowling, but that was a different feeling. Basically, I just wanted to bowl a good ball, get the first one out of the way. And then Hoff came up to me after that ball and was like, there's never going to be a harder ball in your life than your first ball in international cricket. So that was nice. Oh, he's so good. He's so good there, Virat Kohli, sweating on it. Yeah, you can clearly see he's a, a class player. Thought I'd give him a bumper, but didn't really get up, and he was absolutely on top of it. Just kind of reminds you just how good these players are and what type of level you're playing at. Yeah, it wasn't too bad in the field. It kind of felt like a scorchers match in a way, so I've had a bit of practice with a bit of the crowd. Great work on debut, Cam Green. Oh, oh. <laughs> that Turn is it up. there. The modern cricketer right there. But yeah, I think the Indians were probably a different level. Just very loud. Can't imagine back in India with 60,000 screaming. So that was very loud, but very cool at the same time. Get on top of that one. Green off the mark. A bit scratchy early, uh, but Finchy down the other end was absolutely awesome. I think every boy came up to him was like, nice work, youngster. Keep going. Yeah, playing well. Having him at the other end definitely helped. But yeah, it was just awesome being out there with him. Obviously he's played, I think that was his 200th game for Australia. So yeah, it helped a lot. Pushed it away to the leg side. He'll have a piece of that, Cam Green. It was a nice confidence boost. Probably the first time where I started to breathe. Yeah, where the nerves went away a little bit. Kind of knowing you got a boundary out the way. Now you can just focus on batting. I haven't hit a BBL six yet. So it was pretty crazy I've hit a international six. Takeaways are just that. You know, the level's so much higher, but still reachable. So even though I haven't got a wicket and I haven't got a 50 or higher, there's definitely some good signs that you can obviously do it. Well, that's hit with power. That's the best shot he's played for his country, Cam Green.